Gentlemen, that was a phenomenal game. It uh, resulted in an 11-0 win for Trinidad and Tobago over the Cayman Islands. We're going to get some interviews with the players very shortly, but uh, in the meantime, let's take a look at how that game went. Uh, Nathan Achim doing very well to get them started and leading the team at the fly half position and uh, missed a few early on. Penalty opportunities were abundant for Trinidad and Tobago, but uh, once they got a try, which looks like this one here, where they've just got the big boys picking and going, trying to get around the corner, multiple attempts, and eventually the, the Cayman defense folded. A little bit overzealous there, and then as he was fixing himself, the big boy dropped over McLaughlin, getting the first five points on the board for Trinidad and Tobago, and in this competition here at the UE Mona Bowl. McLaughlin was pretty happy with that one. Some of the Trinidad and Tobago fans there. And once a team started finding his range, then it was a kind of game over for Cayman. Uh, they didn't manage to get their boots on with a, a couple of attempts, but uh, really Trinidad Tobago were, were dominant throughout that game and really worked well with their wings and their kicking game definitely beats out this Cayman attempt. A lot of pressure here as well, but again, the kicking game in general has been a lot better. But you can see the the strength in width with Trinidad and Tobago. And again, that kicking range was found from Achim. And he sealed the deal for this team, led them well for the first game. And Kevin Morrell gets it over at 11 points to zero, our first game of the day. Freddie Robson, the captain of Cayman Islands. Freddie, not the best start that you, that, or the start that you would have wanted, uh, but coming off of that game, what have you learned about your team and what do you need to work on for the rest of the, the tournament? Yeah, as you said, it wasn't the best start there for us. Uh, we I thought we prepared a lot better than was shown on the pitch, but I know what we're able to do in training, and just need, if we just replicate that on the pitch, we're going to start winning games. All right. Well, all the best for the rest of the tournament, yeah. Freddie. Thanks, sir. Yeah. So that was Freddie Robson there, the captain of Cayman Islands. Let's talk now to Nathan Achim, the captain for Trinidad and Tobago. Uh, you would have finished behind Cayman Islands last time around. This time you're above them uh, so far this tournament. What do you, did you like about that performance from your team? I think this win is a very good thing for the boys because it's going to give them a lot of confidence for the rest of the tournament. And hopefully from now on we'll keep up this intensity and win our, the rest of our games. All right, Nathan. Well, we'll see how that works out for you. Yeah. Yeah, so that was Nathan Achim there, the captain from Trinidad and Tobago. We take a quick break. When we come back, we'll have more action in the men's under-19 tournament, Guyana. They'll play against Bermuda. <laughs> 